With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, our question is Two thin slabs of refractive index mu1 and mu2 are placed parallel to each other in the xz plane. If the direction of the propagation of a ray in the two media are along the vectors vector r1 equals to ai cap plus bj cap and r2 equals to ci cap plus dj cap then we have so this is the diagram okay so firstly it is given that vector r1 and vector r2 so let vector r this let this is vector r okay this is vector r okay and this is vector R2. This is vector R1 and this is vector R2. Okay. Now let this the y-axis. Y-axis be V and its y-axis be D. And this x-axis is A and this uh, its x-axis be C. Okay. Now the angle made by this uh, incident side theta 1 and angle made by this side theta 2 okay now now by Snell's law we can write that by Snell's law by Snell's law by Snell's law so what is the Snell's law Snell's law is the refractive index of the uh, incident side sin theta equals to the refractive in incidence of refractive side okay sin theta okay so we we'll write it here. It's refractive index is mu one, and angle is sine. Boy, angle is theta one. So sine theta one equals to mu two, and here angle is theta two. So so sine theta two. So this is the sine uh, Snell's law. Now we'll find the value of sine theta one, sine theta two. So sine theta one. So the value of sine theta is perpendicular upon hypotenuse. So here perpendicular is a and hypotenuse is this line so we don't know the value of this so we will put here Pythagoras theorem so Pythagoras theorem is uh, hypotenuse is equals to under root of base square plus uh, uh, perpendicular square so here is so we can write here is uh, perpendicular is a upon hypotenuse uh, upon hypotenuse so here uh, value of hypotenuse is under root a square plus b square now sin theta 2 so sin theta 2 similarly here also perpendicular upon hypotenuse so here we will get perpendicular is here is c c and hypotenuse will be under root of c square plus d square okay now we will put these values but in this Snell's law so we will get mu 1 sin theta is a divided by under root a square plus b square equals to mu 2 c divided by under root c square plus d square so this is our answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today